How can artificial neural networks learn complex patterns? Today we're diving into one of the core mechanisms that enable the learning, activation functions. A neural network, at its most basic, is a series of nodes or neurons, each capable of processing information. They are usually dot product calculators, which is a simple calculation. These neurons connect to form a complex web of information processing units. Each neuron takes an input, processes it, and then passes it on. But how does a neuron pass on? That's where activation functions come into play. Imagine a neuron as a gatekeeper. It receives various signals and needs to process and to pass them on. The activation function is a non-linear mathematical function that allows the neural network to learn non-linear properties in the input data. There are several types of activation functions, each with its unique characteristics. Some of the most commonly used ones are the sigmoid, hyperbolic tangents, and ReLU. The sigmoid function, for example, outputs a value between 0 and 1, making it a great choice for binary classification problems. On the other hand, the ReLU function, short for rectified linear unit, outputs the input directly if it's positive, otherwise it outputs 0. It's simple and efficient, making it a popular choice in many neural network models. But why are activation functions so crucial, you might wonder? They add a necessary layer of complexity and nonlinearity to neural networks. Without them, a neural network would simply be a linear regression model, incapable of solving complex problems. To wrap up, we've learned that an activation function is a mathematical function used by neurons in a neural networks. They come in various forms, each with unique characteristics and use cases. And most importantly, they add complexity and nonlinearity to neural networks.